Today, I will be playing the new F1 24 game on the lowest difficulty, showing just how bad 0% AI is. Here we go then. 0% AI, what have you got for us? The lights are on, the engine's revving, and we are racing. Max Verstappen simulator underway. Let's overtake the whole... Okay, all right, Nico Hulkenberg. Illegal! Oh, there's the man Ocon. That's a good start to the challenge. Right, up the inside into turn one. We've been absolutely squeezed. A treat on the inside through that corner. Can we find room around the outside of the Aston? Yes, we can. And teammate Sergio Perez as well. Yes, Bottas flying in this race. I know that's Joe up in a PA. Go on, boy. Uh, Alonso's in seven. We're going to try and find our way through these guys. They're so slow through the high speed sections. Come on, come on, come on. Yes, that's it. Alonso just darted out of the way there. Going to go for a big lunge on these drivers. I can get maybe two of them. Get the... Yes, we get the Mercedes as well. Russell. Now, Charles Leclerc. Let's get the exit. Hamilton was actually on pole, I believe. And Russell was up there too. So, I don't know what's happened to Russell. But right around the outside of these guys. And then we'll get the inside for this next corner on Hamilton. Yes. Piastri, though, where are you going to go? We're going to go right around the outside of him. And that... Is Max Verstappen simulator over? Oh, 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 oh! That was uh, that was a big moment. That's not going to help in our challenge. To we still gain time. My tire temps are skyrocketing. Look at that, 133 degrees. Wonder how hot they get through these corners. Oh my god! Oh my god! Look at the the surface temperature gets up to about 180 degrees. Let's get past these drivers quickly. Magnussen's out of the way. Ricardo will be next. He will also get out of the way. That's good news. Okay, up into lap of 19. Max is actually going to follow me through and overtake Daniel Ricardo. What a cheeky maneuver that is. Hulkenberg, thank you. Ocon's next. How will he get out of the way? He doesn't, but we can go right around the outside of him. Sergeant does a great job, and I think Ocon's going to follow through and take that position. As does Sonoda and Gasly. And that is past all of the back markers. Get out of the way. Why is he not getting out of the way? Hey, 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 hey. Get out of the way. I've got to get a move on. Thank you, Lance. At least somebody, somebody saw me. I want to get past Joe without letting Bottas through. How slow are they through these fast rights? Quite slow. We're going to go past Bottas there. Let's get past Joe as well. Good stuff. That front left is not having a good time, though. Look at that. 23%. Compared to 7% on the rear right. That is very off-balanced. Perez, what are you doing down here? You should be at second position. Why are you ninth? Pass Alonso. Pass the Ferrari. Russell should get out of the way here. He does. Oh, that was a big send for me into that corner. Actually, send me down slightly. Oh, my God. Round the outside of sights. We got him. We've got Norris. Piastri still currently in second. But will we help Hamilton through here? We're going to go round the outside of Lewis. Piastri's going to get out of the way. Does Hamilton overtake him? No, they're all fine. Hamilton stays behind Piastri. And we've got past everyone. Okay, back to driving by myself then. Tire wear now 31% on that front left tire. It is absolutely disgusting at the moment. Also, I've been in hot lap mode since about lap two or three in this race. So the fact that we're still on 30% and I haven't changed it, I've just kept it in hot lap mode, goes to show that hot lap mode doesn't really deplete the battery that much. How does Max Verstappen find this fun on a Sunday? There is no one anywhere near me at the moment. I don't even know where everybody is. Where is everyone? Surely I've got to be catching up to them soon. I suppose this could also be said for Logan Sargent's race, couldn't it? Being at the back as well. With no one to be seen. Oh, there we are. I can see them. They're just in the distance as we start lap 15 of this Qatar Grand Prix. Daniel Ricciardo at the back. Not what anybody wants to see, but he's going to get out of the way. Thank you very much. Should be Magnussen next, because I think Magnussen was cheeky. Will he be cheeky again? Will he nick past his teammate of Nico Hulkenberg? We get round the outside of him. I think he might, actually. I think he might overtake his teammate in a similar fashion. Sergeant, get out of the way. Ocon doesn't know where to go. Yuki Sonoda. Where are you going to go? Where are you going to go? Where are you going to go? We're going to go round the outside here. Yes. What I'm most excited for when I come back around the track is to see whether Magnussen once again has overtaken somebody by following me. Albon's up first. There he is. We finally found him. On the outside. Yes, that's one. Lance Stroll, though. What is he going to do? Go right around the outside here at the hairpin. And then it's Joe. No, right, Joe. What you need to do, you need to let me pass right here. Yeah, that's nice. Oh, God, I went very deep, but I think it's going to be okay. Bottas will slow down. Joe will follow through. Come on, Joe. Overtake him. I think he's done it. Bottas came to a complete stop there. That was so weird. But that is one way to get past. Yes, Joe. Perez, what are you doing here again? Oh, that's very wide. 
but it's going to help us overtake Perez. Sainz will go slowly. Come on, Perez, for the team. And he's okay, done it. Sweet. Yes, Perez. Good overtake. We're going to go right around the outside of Alonso here. Russell will slow down. Alonso, I think, will get past him. And then we're going to go around the outside at the hair. Bit of Leclerc and Piastri. Don't know where to go. Piastri all over the place. Hamilton as well. He's going to get out of the way. No, that was Norris. Now it's Piastri, who I'm going to overtake in towards this next left-hander. He's going to slow down. Norris has now shot up into third position. It's a McLaren 2-3 at this stage of the race. Oh, my God. Back end, back end. Oh, my God. Is that tyres? 50% on the front left. Oh, my God. That's horrendous. To be fair, it could be just like real life. Remember the real life Grand Prix in 23? Everybody had to only do 18 laps on their tyres. We're at lap 18 at the moment. My front left is at 53%. We're ignoring it, though. We're going to do more than 18 laps. Still just running on hot lap mode. It just doesn't go down. The battery stays fine. You can just run hot lap mode for the whole race. Carlos Sainz is out of this race. Has he crashed? Has he had a failure? He has just had a failure for Carlos Sainz. Out of this race, engine failure, his day's done. What's Bottas doing down here? What's happened to Bottas? Maybe he's made a piss. Where are you going, Bottas? Where are you going? Stay in your lane, please. Oh, he's going to block me here. No, he's going to get out of the way perfectly. Thank you very much, Ricardo. Thank you, Hulkenberg. Yeah, Magnussen's overtaken Hulkenberg. Right, can we do it again, K-Mag? Oh, my God, where are you going? Right, okay, I'm going to get you past Sergeant now, K-Mag. You need to follow me through the middle. Oh, my days. Maybe we just do it. Do we just carry on? Let's carry on. Let's carry on. That was easy enough. Let's just get past Gasly here. And there we go. Oh, okay. That was nicely done. Okay, right. So, Noda will be up next. And then we've got everybody in that bottom five. He's in 12 for the moment. So, he's doing a really good dot. Piastri, he's made a pit stop. They are down here at the moment in 11th position right now. We're going to get past Oscar Piastri. I'm going to keep going. I don't think I'm going to get a puncher this lap. We're on 71%. So, he should be okay. I think we'll get to 75 by the end of the lap. Then we come into the pit. Albon, Stroll, and a kick car, which I think is Joe is up next. We get past these two. Remember, if you're enjoying this F124 content and you're looking forward to watching more F124 content, make sure you hit that subscribe button as we overtake Joe Guan Yu and we hunt down the leaders to put them three laps down. 74% on that front left. I think it's time to box. I don't know how to make a pit stop, where the line is. Where is the line? There? No, there. We lost a little bit of time coming into the pit lane. I want to be ahead of that cluster that I overtook earlier. I don't want to be behind the back markers. There they are. That's going to be Sonoda. It's going to be close. Is he going to get us? No, he doesn't. That's perfect. And now we push on new hard tyres. There's Oscar Piastri putting three laps down. We're going to put him... Oh, my God. We're going to put him three laps down again. Oh, he was carrying very little speed through that corner compared to myself. Although we may lose out a little bit of time here. We've got Albon, Stroll, and Joe once again. We can go around the outside of Albon here, I reckon. Yep. Stroll, same through this corner. And then Joe's going to be easy. Okay, that was nice. And we are running low on battery. So we're going to go back to medium for a couple of laps. Get it back and then go hot lap for the rest. Look at this cluster of cars. Perez is the first one. We're going to go around the outside. Whoa, that was nearly taken off my front wing on Sergio Perez there. George Russell It's going to be easy. We also got Fernando Alonso then. Lewis Hamilton will go right around the outside of him. And Norris, who slams on the brakes. That's going to allow Hamilton through, surely. As who's this? Charles Leclerc. Charles Leclerc still in second position at the moment. All these drivers yet to box. It's only Piastri. Right, we're back up to 96% on battery. So I'm going to put it into hot lap mode. I was just about to ask the question, where is everybody on track? Where are they all? There they are. I can see them. I believe that's Daniel Ricciardo, and it is. He's going to be my first victim to go four laps down. Famously said he likes them vulnerable. He's vulnerable at the moment, and I've got him. Bottas is next. I'm going to go right around the outside of Bottas. Hulkenberg has been overtaken by Kevin Magnussen. Can we get Magnussen past Ocon? Ocon's going to slam on. Magnussen's going to follow through. No, Ocon's blocked it. Okay. As we've got drivers in the lead, now starting to make pit stops as Gasly. So slow through the left-hander there. Around the outside here. It's not really an overtaking spot, but we've done it. Around the outside of this corner. Yes, beautiful. Beautiful overtakes we're making at the moment. Right, I can spot those leaders who are yet to make a pit stop. Norris doesn't get in the way. That's perfect. We're on a really good lap at the moment, so I kind of want to see this one out and see what I can do on Hamilton. I do think I might get DRS off him as well, which is great. That's going to help me fly past Charles Leclerc, and he does. I do get DRS there. Let's get the DRS open. Follow Charles Leclerc. Everybody else is in the pit lane. We're going to overtake those guys now who have done the overcut. And apart from Piastri, 
That's everybody now four laps down. Right, here's Oscar Piastri. This should be nice and easy right around the outside of the hairpin. And it is. There we go. Up into... Well, we're still into the lead, but we've now lapped everyone four laps down. And we're over the halfway stage. Daniel Ricciardo is going to be the first driver to be overtaken and go five laps down. And then it's the two Haas cars. Hulkenberg still behind Magnussen for the time being. He will get out of the way, as will Magnussen on the left there. Maybe a bit too slow. It might allow Hulkenberg through. He doesn't. But he won't be able to get past Ocon. This, this tactic to help Magnussen through the pack. Sally come to a stop now as he's unable to get past. He's letting me through now. He's going too slow. Sonoda's up next. And then it's Sargent who is ahead of Yuki Sonoda and into P13 at the moment. Sargent doing a decent job. That Williams, I guess, working quite well because Albon's even further up the road. 20 laps to go. I am going to have to lift and coast because if you look at that, that is worrying at the moment. Tire wear. 26%. I think that should be fine. Bottas has caught back up to Stroll and Joe. But I believe he's got another pit stop to make. We go very deep into the hairpin. But it's an easy way to get past all of them. Joe's going to let me through. And we're going to move past ninth position now. Joe's in the points. He's doing a great job. Like I said, even with lifting and coasting, we're still massively faster than the AI at the moment. Going to get past Norris. Going to get past Alonso. Nearly darted back to the racing line. And then we're going to make an attempt on getting past the next guys. I think that's Perez. So he has actually made up some positions in this race. And I've somehow got DRS on the cars ahead. So I'll take it. It's going to help me. Perez is going to get out of the way. He's a good teammate. He knows he's the number two. And around the outside of Lewis Hamilton we go. George Russell will also slam on the brakes. Nearly takes out his teammate in the process. Who is going to overtake him. And get himself up in a fourth. There's Charles Leclerc. Oh, we're right stuck behind. That's probably the worst position so far, we've come up to an AI driver when lapping them. Piastri actually has quite a sizable lead over the rest of the field. He may be able to make a pit stop and still come out ahead. That was close. Ahead of the rest of the pack. Nah, maybe not ahead. But he should definitely have the tyres go on the charge. Okay, Piastri's in the 39s. I'm in the 27s with this fuel saving. So we're 12 seconds a lap quicker. And the driver in second place. Who is on, like, the best tyres at the moment? Hello once again, Daniel Ricciardo. He's going to get out of the way. We give each other miles of room either side. Hulkenberg's next. Fly around the outside. Magnussen has got past Ocon. We're going to get past Ocon. Magnussen's ahead now. I don't think I'm going to be able to help him out. He is going to slow down, though. That might cost him. No, I don't think it will. Ocon still will be fine. And we get DRS. That's great news. Gazzy's up next. He's going to let me through. Nice and easy. He doesn't really have to slow down too much. As we just fly around the outside of the corner. There's Yuki Tsunoda actually losing. Logan Sargent was close last time around. So we go purple through sector one. Hello. That was with a little bit of lifting and coasting as well. Logan Sargent, please be nice. Please be nice. Please be nice. Where are you going to go? Where are you going to go? Where are you going to go? I'm going to go inside. Oh my god, that was close. This is Valtteri Bottas. I don't think... No, maybe he's just made his pit stop. He's on to hard tyres. Yeah, Bottas got a hard tyres till the end. Bit of a weird strategy called medium, medium hards. Alex Albon has dipped away from... Oh my god, where are you going, Alex? Where are you going? Oh my days. Okay, Alex Albon dipped away from these two who are fighting up ahead. Joe is still holding on to that P9 position. He's having a fantastic race. Stroll is going to get a great opportunity here because he's going to let me from the inside. Then Joe's just going to stab on the brakes. Stroll could follow through and he does. I've just cost Joe that ninth position here in Qatar. Oscar Piastri's made that pit stop and now we're going to go for the overtake on the McLaren driver. Around the outside of Norris here. That's nice and tidy. There we go. Six laps for Norris. And there is Alonso. And he gets out of the way very, very easily indeed. Perez should get out of the way here. And he does. This could be difficult though. Around the outside seems to be our best bet on the zero AI. Hamilton is confused in this race. He doesn't know where to go. We get him anyway. We get Leclerc. That's six laps for everybody so far. But can we do a seventh? We've got ten laps left to go. Perfect scenario here is Oscar Piastri cuts his way through the field, battles with them a little bit, slows them down, helps us out. How are we picking these fastest laps out? I'm fuel saving at the moment. Fuel saving or not, I can see a couple more back markers. Stanley Ricardo, Esteban Ocon, who's not having a good race, but this is going to hurt us. Again, just catching them up at the worst possible time. Ricardo just stopped in the way there. Hulkenberg and Gazi's next. Magnussen's getting his way through. We got the inside of Hulkenberg here. He's going to give us the room. Gassi inside again. And Magnussen in P14, I believe that is at the moment, or 15. 
We've got past him as well. Those were not good places to overtake AI. Definitely cost us time. Yuki Tsunoda, he's going to get out of the way very, very easily. We're going to pick up some slipstream, though. That's going to help us down in towards turn one. And then hopefully he doesn't slam on his brakes and take us out. Where's he going to go? We're going to go right around the outside of him. There we go. Nicely done. Outside of Sonoda, he's now seven laps down. Sergeant's having a great race at the moment. Still P13. Sadly, it won't be any points in that position. Overtaking those back markers now is putting me in a false sense of security that I'm definitely going to get those guys and put them seven laps down as well. But I just don't know. I caught up to them quite quickly. I feel like the field obviously has spread out a lot in this race. That those leaders could still be, at the moment, you know, going through turn one. I don't know. What I do know is I've got a kick Sauber car of Valtteri Bottas that I'm going to overtake there. And I'm going to put him seven laps under. I'm going to get past Alex Albon now. He's in 11. We've got to send up the inside. He was going to be very, very slow if we hesitated. And Joe has once again got past Stroll. But once again, I'm catching up to the Isu. No, it's going to work. Stroll's going to slow down. And I should be able to get Joe around the outside here without him breaking and allowing Stroll through. And he does. He's going to stay in ninth position at the moment. I just spotted a car in the distance. That might be one of our leaders, but it could also be Piastri. Also depends how quickly has Oscar Piastri caught up to those leaders. It might look like we're close to them, but Piastri could be miles off them still. There's Piastri. I can't see anybody else on the radar at the moment. Piastri's going to get out of the way, and I think I might have just spotted a car in the distance. So we are closing on the leaders at the moment. Norris, where are you going to let me through? I'm going to go inside here. Thank you. There's Alonso. He's going to get out of the way, and I think he might have just given me DRS. It's going to help me massively. We've also got to 60% on tyre wear. Perez is up next. He's going to get out of the way. He'll slam on his brakes. Russell will move over to the right. That's good. Then it's Charles Leclerc, and then, then it's Lewis Hamilton, who's currently leading this race. Leclerc blocked us last time. He doesn't this time. We're going to go around the outside of Hamilton, and we do. That is seven laps that we have got on the 0% AI so far. Let's not get too ahead of ourselves, though. We are still on the cusp with fuel we can't be too greedy there we go it didn't take long it was in the same lap there's ricardo oh my god where's he going where's he going we've gone off track we've got him anyway and there's esteban ocon let's pick up some slipstream on the alpine drivers ricardo's gonna come back at us uh excuse me daniel no 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 you don't no you don't run the outside of ocon nice and simple can we maybe even get stroll albon and Joe. That might be a little bit more difficult, but I'm going to push anyway. There's Hulkenberg. There's Gasly. Magnussen in, his, in a world of his own at the moment with some great overtakes to move up in a 15th place, just following me through most of the time. There's Sonoda. He's going to get out of the way nicely for us. That's 14th position. That are eight laps down. Where is Sargent? Where is Albon? Bottas, Stroll, and Joe. They're the possibilities. Final lap of this Qatar Grand Prix then. We've gone fastest with a 25-6. It's going to be simple on Sergeant. He's going to move over to the right-hand side. He's going to get out of our way. And we're going to try and hunt down Valtteri Bottas on this last lap. Where's Bottas? Are we going to get him? I can't see him anywhere at the moment. I could just see Bottas there going around the final corner to end this race. He's going to live to fight another day. But for us, we're going to come across the line and we're going to put the whole field seven laps down. And that is what it is like to be Max Verstappen on F124. <laughs> because everyone was over seven laps down. Nobody in the race was classified. Everybody was a DNF.